Moisturizer with sunscreen because that's a lot of words. I don't want to say all that. And I am in college. I'm 19 years old. I'm a sophomore at Southern Oregon University in Ashland, Oregon. It's a truly beautiful campus. I can actually I'll insert some videos or pictures of it at some point in this video so you can see it. It's it's honestly truly beautiful and I love this school and everything about them about it here. So I <laughs> So um right now I'm in summer school taking online classes and um me and my friend are getting an apartment and we're gonna get that finalized hopefully this week. So the first thing I'm gonna do is, um, I guess kind of prime my face with this L'Oreal Lumi Glotion. I love this stuff. I have it in the the darker shade. So the name. Nine the two, like the medium shade, because I'm a tannish girl. So. I'll just use my hand. I hope I'm able to like work with this video because now I got cut into two separate videos and I really am not sure yet how to splice or whatever videos together like that. So we're, it's a learning process. That's why it's not gonna be uploaded today. So I'm gonna be taking my ABH dip brow in pomade in the shade chocolate, which is really old and really bad. And so I actually try to use like I'm also gonna apply some chapstick. This is the best chapstick I've ever used in my entire life. Um, this is my friend's who's I'm house sitting for. I'm gonna take a drop. It's like it's clove oil. Never heard of it, but I'm just gonna take a drop and like put that in my dip brow because it is kind of dry. I know, probably not the best idea. This stuff actually. Smells kind of strong. Prep my brows with my Bravo conditioning primer. I can you can you guys see that? That's backwards, isn't it? I it's upside. Might not be backwards in the actual video, but I'm looking at it backwards. So um, if you can't tell, I have a really thin brow not thin I have really yeah I guess thin well not thick I have really yeah thin um thin brows and so um they are very like light and a lot of the time it doesn't look like I have any so since this makeup tutorial if this get ready with me is not going how I planned for it to because none of my foundations work. Actually, I haven't been wearing foundation at all since I've been here. I was just going to do it for this video. But sorry, um, I'm going to try and actually do kind of, I guess, like a boy beat since I'm not, I've kind of been loving those. And I actually haven't, I guess you could say I've been doing boy beats because I don't wear a lot of makeup on my face as of right now and so um i guess you c this could be a boy beat i actually am gonna fill in my brows though since i don't have any so i'm just like sparsely filling in my brows like nothing crazy as you can i guess it, it's it's a big difference from that to that but it's nothing like super crazy and so um for me at least i don't do like crazy brows and even if i go out with like my friends and so, um, yeah, that's the brow all done. Nothing, we're not doing anything more to it other than like setting it. Oh my God. 
Mm. Hold on, I just need to regain my train of thought. I'm just gonna brush my brow hairs up to give them like a very kind of like messy-ish look. Like that, yeah. And then, um, I'm gonna do like a minimal. I really only put like concealer under my eyes. I know like the most boy beat tutorials and like they like want you to keep they they don't want you they choose to like not show their like eye bag or to sh to show their eye bags um but i personally don't really have them i get well i guess i do i do have eye bags but um it's really like paley here compared to the rest of my skin and my concealer color is like literally like not anything crazy anyway so I'm just gonna put a little bit just like that and I'm gonna that's the only place I'm putting concealer I don't put it anywhere else usually and I'm gonna unless I'm doing like a full face and then I'm going to um just blend that in with my finger Should have one side. At, I should have done one side at a time so you guys could see like this. I'm gonna be doing blush. I'm gonna do, how to do like that flush look that everyone does. Cause I just, it is so beautiful and I just want to do it so bad. I am so like I said in the beginning, I'm going into my sophomore year of college. I um, I'm a business hospitality major. So business major with an emphasis in hospitality and tourism management. And that is because I want to be an event planner. I want to plan like weddings, birthdays, all that good stuff. Um, even like just um, conferences and meet and greet, stuff like that. I just want to plan all of that. And so um, that's my major. And then I'm going to do a certificate and it's the wine business certificate, which means I will learn everything that has to be known about like a winery. I'm going to be using the um, Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 hour blush in Feisty because this is the only blush I have with me and I like their blush. So. I'm not even gonna tap it off because I want it. I'm going for that like flushed look. I'm actually gonna add it to like my nose too because I know a lot of people do that and I think it looks so cute. The only thing I'm probably gonna be doing today is going and doing laundry, which um, these are like school apartments that, my, that I'm staying in right now. So um, I have to like walk to the laundry room. So hopefully no one like makes fun of me. I mean, I think I look cute, but some people don't and that's okay. I'm actually gonna connect it. I think I wanna connect like my nose and cheek blush color, whatever. Okay, yeah, so, um, I like that actually a lot. I think it looks super duper cute. So now I'm gonna do some highlighter. And I have this Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder in the shade, um, Precious Petals. Sometimes it takes a while to find the names on these. Now that I, um, it's summer and I'm really feeling like the vibes of like, the sun and the glowy look we about to try to make ourselves glow and I like this one because it's like pink and I want it to go with like the the pink of the the blush it's kind of so it like blends in a little bit just I love like a I kind of look like a medium glow I'm like a medium glow kind of girl I like that okay You'll see what I'm about to do, but I'm going to finish this highlight first. A lot of people that I know, if they watch this, are probably going to be like, why did you start a YouTube channel? You're not like good or anything like that. And 
honestly, the reason I did it was for just for me because um, especially since I'm literally only working and doing online classes, I'm not even doing like on campus classes, I have nothing to do half the time. So um, giving myself something to do, YouTube has really helped, is like probably going to be like that thing that I do that like takes up the time that I literally am doing nothing. And I don't mind that. Like, I don't mind sitting down on like videos like every day or something. Like and giving some content. Even if nobody's watching it, like for me, it still feels nice because that way I'm not like absolutely bored out of my mind. Like I have been the past couple like days. I've been here for almost two weeks now. Um school got out three weeks ago. I went home for a week, took a week off from work, went home and visited my family, saw like my pets and my boyfriend and everybody. That was really nice it was well needed but um so i'm gonna put it up here this brush actually is a little too big for this i'm gonna use this one it's actually an eyeshadow brush i'm not saying any of the names of the brushes because these aren't that good well i kind of like them i think they work really well but they're they're just this bestow brand most of them but they don't really have any like this type of brush. it's like a more for you this type of brush or you know something like that so um I really like these brushes, Bestope. It doesn't have a name. It literally just says... Can you see that? It's blurry. That's fine. It usually just says... It literally just says Bestope, but I think these brushes work really, really well for me. Personally, eyeshadow face, I like them. I think I got it on, like, Amazon. I'm actually going to take this blush like it's a bronzer and, like contour my nose I kind of have like a little bit not like a gigantic nose but it's not like slim I'm gonna bring it up like there like that if you can tell what I did I just kind of brought it like I was gonna contour my nose and then put it like on the divot right there I kind of looked like a, a who right there like a who I'm gonna take this elf the lip scrub stuff. So I'm going to just use my chapstick. I love I swear by this chapstick. I have like six packs of it. I get it at Dollar Tree. I know that sounds sketch, but this brand chapstick, I, I it, you see that? Absolutely love. I'm just going to just curl them just a little bit, just because. Because they are visors and they're not super long, they always kind of look weird whenever I curl them. I don't know if it's because I'm curling them wrong. But... Now I'm just going to use my Benefit Bad Girl Bang... Bad Gal Bang mascara. I actually used this for the first time yesterday. I've had it. Sorry if I gotta listen to covers, like remixes, like I wanna hear the good one. Gotta kinda hear the good, I don't even know what I just said there. Okay, I'm not about to lie, I kinda miss Fetty Wap. I liked his music. For anybody who thinks otherwise, block me. I'm just kidding, don't do that, just kidding. Um, I really, really like his music. I think he's good. And he's in that Fifth Harmony song that I love. Um, oh, the Flex song by Fifth Harmony. Um, All in my head. Flex. Flex. That one. He's in that one, and I love that song. I think he does so good. I think they do so good. I know. I'm pretty sure they're not a group anymore, like, at all anymore. Like, I know that, obviously, Camila Cabello left. I don't even think I just said her name right, but she's adorable. I love her music. I think Normandy, Norm, I don't know how to say her name, but her and that Love Life song with Khalid, Khalid, all about it. I'm just going to spray with my Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water. I know, I know, I know. It's not actual rose water or whatever, da -da 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 -da, but it makes the skin, fins feel good. Really? It makes my skin feel good and I set the little tester one anyway so 
I find something. If there's something better, let me know. But as of right now, so I'm going to use. I feel like it just kind of brings like a like life back to my face. Like it just makes me feel very um, refreshed and rejuvenated.